he likes to walk a lot. Whatever task he has outside the house, Mousy tries to go by foot. After walking half his life, skipping cars and trams whenever possible, hardly even biking or taking a bus, Mousy one day decided to pause. Without any special reason, he decided to sit all day, his eyes closed. Was trying to walk the known paths he could recall out of his imagination. Mousy discovered, by his big surprise, in the closest neighborhood, his imagination could miss the whole house. He could fix it by concentrating on all the bright spots nearby that his memory could recall. The further he walked to the images, trying to glide his gaze from one spot to another, the harder it was to keep moving step by step. Mousy was sitting eagerly, projecting images out of his memory. Thoughts in the form of images were not always connecting. They were jumping and jumping, jumping more and more. The further he left from the destination he walked every day, more disconnected were the images, less smooth was the walk. Uh-huh. 
this led Mousy to look at his walking from closer. The next time Mousy went for a walk, he was trying to remember as many details as he could. And when coming back to his sofa, he immediately repeated his walk in the inner projection inside his head. No matter how skipping and dropping it was, he discovered one thing that calmed him to continue with passion. Mousy got aware of the fact that no matter what walk he took in his life, it always had finished where it started from. And after all, in the thoughts, it may not be so much different. Meeting the other pedestrians next time on his walk, he was guessing into which of the two possible categories they belong. Some of them will be walking from birth to death. And no matter where around the world they will travel to, will finish their life close to the same place they were born. The others will change places, maybe switch to another continent, and their life route will not match back in return. Mousy kept walking, walking. Mousy kept seeing, walking. Mousy kept sitting, walking in his imagination. Until one day he found a solution that connected all the people together. The ones that walk from birth to death in a close swing and the ones that die elsewhere but they were born. Mousy discovered the center of the earth. In the center of the earth there is a hook and every pedestrian on this world 
is constantly swinging attached over a long distance onto it. People when walking are like pendulums. With each step they make, they are gently swinging. No matter what distance from one person to the other, the lifelong distance of all the humans to each other stays the same. By every step, by every move, from my side or from your side, there is the same distance to where Mousy walks right now. <laughs> it is 6,350 kilometers to the middle of the Earth from you where you are right now and it is 6350 kilometers from the center of the earth to Mars. It might seem a lot, but this was not so for the Mousy that day when his life had changed. Of course, he immediately performed the calculation in which he added all the walks of his life and all the thoughts of his life in one curved surface. And this way his mind has merged with the surface of the earth. His walking, with his thinking and with all the images he was carrying in his head, it had all mapped into one experience. And when seeing it all at the same time, walking while sitting, he realized he never had moved anyway. At the very moment he realized this, he said it loud. Everything moves but me. My body is always occupying the same very space in the universe. And the voice said, On the count of one, you will wake up where you're sitting right now. Ten. You feel warm. Nine. The warmth penetrates your spine out of your belly. 8. You're getting heavier. 7. Your eyes are interlocking green. 6. There is a yellow circle you see in the green. 5. You will do what my voice says. 4. Mousy. Now you are entering your dreams. Three. There is all white that you see. Two. My voice will be guiding you. One. Welcome to the place you are sitting right now. Mousy suddenly realized he is slain on a soft sofa and his imagination was moving the images. It nearly felt like walking. And the voice said, There is no images that move. All what moves is your attention. Your head is fixed, gazing in the horizon and horizon is locked in the projection screen. No 
nobody will forget the images you've seen just now. They will stick there in your head. And remind you We are all prisoners of war.